ain't she pretty right there? Hello YouTube, this is Bash Break Repeat and I'm giving you an unboxing slash testing of the XP Digital DS1510MG. So this servo comes in at about 139 ounces of torque and a 0.15 transit speed. And um, if you remember from one of my previous videos, my RC 8.2E review, I did not like the servo for the A-scale buggy because it did not provide enough torque for the application that it was in. But So I decided to give it another shot, bought another one of these for my 10-scale uh, uh, two-wheel drive slash. And I decided to be a little step above the Traxxas 2075 um, waterproof uh, servo. So this should give me a little bit more speed, a little bit more torque, and it's metal geared, so it's also very good. Uh, it comes with a... V very long ex uh, servo extension cord. This measures about about I think it was whenever I measured it, it was about 10 inches. So it's it's pretty long. Fits almost all applications. It's good. So if you want to use it for a plane, small plane, uh, you can use that for it. But uh, anyways, I will be now moving on to the servo testing of the speed and a real life application of the car. Alright, I just got my servo installed. As you can see here, my uh, slash two wheel drive LCG chassis. And um, here is testing of it moving the tires on the car. Ignore the uh, creaking if you can hear it. It's just for me. I haven't cleaned the car in a while, so. But it's pretty dang fast for a 20, 20, well actually $30 servo. So I think that will work for any basher or beginner racer servo if you uh, don't want to spend the big bucks for a nice uh, servo like this. You can also get like this one. And this one's very good for the price.